Hey everybody, your host AMF1534 here, and let's uh let's play something. And uh, no, we're not playing Cage No Tao, even though that game is awesome. That's not why I brought you here today, because we're gonna play this instead. Super Mario Galaxy! Woohoo! By the way, in case you're wondering what that crazy, crazy layout is going on there, this is my uh, modded Wii, and that's my interface, and it's pretty sick. Uh, I'm trying to remember what it's called. I think it's called like Wii Flow. It's pretty tight. Kind of holds it. Kind of takes like all of your stuff you have out there, puts it together. Anyways, before I get ahead of myself, let me be the first to welcome you to Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2. We're not going to be playing on that one, because that's my main one. Even though I haven't actually completed the game yet, but that's not the point. That one's not mine either, it's a friend of mine, so we'll do, uh, File 2. Of course, why not? We'll, uh... Well, you know, we'll use my other one, why not? That's one of my other nicknames that many people know about. Alright, so... Zero stars. World One, the great space journey begins. Now, let me tell you a story, a new story, that also begins with stardust. Shimmering stardust falls on the Mushroom Kingdom once a century. That time had come again. Would you like to share some cake while we watch the shooting stars? Meet me at the castle! Yeah, there he is. There's the man of the hour. <laughs> More like the man of the 25 years. <laughs> He's been around for a while. The Star Festival had just begun. Toads everywhere were celebrating. The star bits rained down from the sky. And then we went through this tube. No, we didn't. Hmm? <laughs> PlayStation controls? The strange little fellow seemed confused. Was he lost? He seemed to take a shine to Mario. And then he locked himself inside of his hat. Mario's cap filled with warmth as he felt a new power surging through him. <laughs> triangle, triangle, um. Alright, so that's the old spin move there. Can I break this, they ask? And it can seem like I haven't saved the world from impending doom for the last, you know, 25 years. What's this? Was one of the little fellow's friends? Of course it was. Where am I, he asks. Does it matter? My phone's ringing, but I'm not gonna answer it right now, because I don't want to. Oh boy. I can hear the sounds of chaos. And those sounds are bad. Holy shit, yep. And there's really, really big Bowser. He's been doing large amounts of steroids and PCP. You're too late, Mario. The power of the stars is already mine. And look what else I got. Gua ha ha! I'm huge! Even scarier up close, huh? Mario! Maybe I'll have Peach bake me something for once. I sure could go for a galaxy-sized slice of cake right now. I'm way too huge for this puny planet. I deserve an empire that's more me-size. And I'll put it in the center of the universe. Have fun with your stupid mushrooms. Because <laughs> I can fly. I have harnessed the ability of interstellar travel. <laughs> oh, 
great. And now the entire Mushroom Kingdom is in a state of pandemonium. And once again, it'll be our job to fix it. As it has been forever. Mario, where did that monster come from? You took your princess to the center of the universe. You must hurry and save her. Oh, Master Luma. Young Master Luma. Did you get thrown overboard too? Good thing you're safe. I see. So you're going to stay in Mario's camp. That should be safe for now. But Mario, you have other things to worry about, like saving the princess. But how? I know. With young Master Luma's help, you can use the power of the stars. And we Lumas can help a little bit too. Good shit. As thanks for saving our friends. We'll send you into space to get that monster. Now, let's go after them. Alright, let's get moving. We've got a long journey ahead. Dun, 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 dun. Kiwi Piranha's temper tantrum, huh? Let's do this. Our power stars, they're gone! Some gigantic monster stole them. If you're going after that monster, you might see our power stars, too. Alright, enough enough narrating. Let's start playing the damn thing. Alright, everybody. Welcome to Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2. One of the most stunning games that there really ever were. And it is my pleasure to be your, your guide throughout the entire journey. You got an extra life. Excelente! Just to answer all the questions now, um, yes, I will be doing a complete run of this game. I will do... I'll be getting all of the stars, every single one of them, including all the green ones. So, get ready for the long haul, everybody. It's gonna be a very long and bumpy ride. Just to answer a question now, am I an absolute prodigy at this game? Absolutely not. Am I good at this game? Yes, I am. So, if you think you're gonna be seeing the most incredible performance in the history of gaming, you're playing the wrong place. You saved me, but the monster got away. Well, then we'll go down after him. This game is an absolute trip, by the way. <laughs> For those of you that have never played a Super Mario Galaxy game, it's pretty much like Super Mario 64 on acid. To put it that way. It's the most accurate way to put it. But yes, as I was saying before, I'm definitely not here to, you know, completely blow through this game. But we're gonna have a lot of fun, so I hope you guys are... I hope you guys are in for the ride. Because we are gonna have a good time. Alright, anywho. We've got some power stars to get. A very whopping load of them. I would love to get through this. <laughs> I need to follow this little guy here. Oh, shit. Give it to me. There we go. Okay. I love these things. Usually, if you can nail that, you're gonna get a nice prize, like that, unless they all fall off. <laughs> Octumbas? Almost like Octoroks from Zelda. I wonder if that's where they got that from, because that wouldn't surprise me in the least. And this is our first form, Rainbow Mario. Being completely invincible. <laughs> completely destroying everybody. Oh. And for extra lives. Come on, come on, come on, come on. And we have it. There we go. Believe me, it'll be completely paramount that you get as many star bits as possible throughout the course of this. You just you just want to do it. We'll put it that way. You don't need to listen to me now, but you'll eventually heed my words. This is going to be a very long LP, you guys. I just, uh, just know that. If you think we're going to get this done in anything less than 50, you're probably dreaming. Ooh. Yeah. Leave no mental stone unturned. I wonder. 
Oh, damn it. This is what gets you sometimes. There we go. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> They're all getting away. There we go. Whoa. God. <laughs> this is, that was awesome. I totally forgot about that. I, I mean, I haven't played this game in quite a few months now, so there's going to be a lot of things that are going to be relatively new to me again, because it's been a while since I've experienced it, so that'll make it even more fun. Why not? Um, I need to make sure I get the Comet Medal out of this level. I need to make sure that I get them all, for that matter. I just don't remember where it is. That's, that's the part that gets me. I know it's here somewhere. You can't hide from me. Oh, there it is right there. I can see it. I see you over there. I see you, baby. Long jump! Oh shit, that was a really stupid idea. <laughs> uh, you'll have to forgive me, that was more or less a completely terrible idea. It's alright though. We got plenty of lives to spare. Why more than we'll ever need at this point. I don't die often, but I'm not saying that I'm not going to die ever, because... That would be very brash of me. I know that I'm absolutely going to die probably more times than I can count on any of my hands combined. Oh, no, you don't. Don't try to coerce me into that yet. I don't have my Comet Medal, and I must have it. Yeah. Collect them to make Comets appear. And in order to completely 100% this game, we will have to get them all, which we will be doing. Always get the red mushroom if you find it, because that gives you three extra hit points. It's like a mini RPG at times. Um, get some more of these free things here. I'm actually surprised that I'm making this video right now. I told myself I wouldn't do it for another week or so, but eh, whatever. <laughs> Sometimes you just do what you gotta do. And guess what, everybody? It's mini-boss time! Well, I guess it'd actually be a full boss. Kinda. Kinda, sorta, not really. Is this boss hard? Absolutely not. We just gotta, you know, hit him directly in the ass. And that'll expose it. And then after that, then we can... Then we can lay the smack down once he comes back over this way. Wham! Now he's pissed. I don't know how that shell just reformed itself onto his ass like that, but that is a song that I'd rather not question. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna pay. You're gonna get it. <laughs> I'm gonna hit that pimple on your ass. I don't think you're gonna get away from me. Yeah. That would hurt pretty bad, though. I must admit. Apparently it hurt him so bad that he completely exploded, and his body was made of a star. And now we're going to get it! Perfect. <laughs> I was really hoping I was going to get that. One down. A shitload to go. Alright, everybody. We now have our very first Comet Medal and our very first star of the game. And this is where we're going to be setting up shop pretty much all the time. So you're this Mario guy my little Loomis won't stop blabbing about, am I right? Sorry to hear about the excitement you had with that monster down in the Mushroom Kingdom. I sure appreciate you bringing us this Power Star, though. We need as many of these as we can get. The name's Lubba, by the by. I'm the head honcho of this Luma crew. Yeah, I can tell you're head honcho, you're fucking huge. <laughs> See, believe it or not, we're on a spaceship right now, and it looks mysteriously a lot like your head. It took some real elbow grease to convert this little planetoid into a ship, but we Lumas pulled it off. It may not look like much, but it's home. Yeah. Truth be told, the ship, she's not in such hot shape right now. We ran into this monster, too. He blasted us with meteors, and some of my crew were thrown overboard. Yeah. So that monster kidnapped your princess, eh? 
That's cold. Deep space cold, if you ask me. You know what else is cold? That monster stealing every last one of our power stars. See, that's our fuel. Our spaceship runs on energy from stars. Without that, we're stranded here. Hey, yo! Is that Young Master Luma? It is, isn't it? Wow. Wait, if you have the trust of a young Master Luma... Hmm. Say, I just might have a little proposition for you. Hear me out now. Your special someone got kidnapped and now you gotta save her, am I right? Yeah. I think you're right. And we need fuel for our ship. Now, if you think you could get... Uh, if you could get some of our stars back for us, I'd be willing to make this ship your very own for a bit. That's a fair exchange, am I right, Mario? Yeah. Alright, it's a deal. Okay, gang, let's get cracking, eh? I want everything sp sp space ship shape, you cheap little bastards. I have an email. And I had a missed call. Got all sorts of shit going on. Alright, this is our new spaceship. Lubba's crew rebuilt the spaceship to look just like Mario. Even though it has Luigi's hair and facial hair. Well, what do you think? Nice spaceship, yeah? More like a face ship. <laughs> sounds like something my dad would say. Well, at least you'll never lose it in a parking lot, am I right? <laughs> it's two awful, awful jokes in a row. So what's next? Don't look at me. The ship has your face on it, not mine. The decision is yours. And yours alone. Feel free to explore Starship Mario. Or take the helm if you're ready to, to ship out. It's your call, Captain. Alright, everybody. The game has been saved. And when you guys come back on the next episode of Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2, we're going to finally get started. I mean, we already have our first star in hand, but we got more things to do. So this is your host, AMF1534, saying thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. See you guys later. Bye.